to the tension for release. Good things come with ease. Don't resist. Cuts and words hold. A very good morning. Welcome to another vlog. It's another day coding with Natty. I remember when my channel used to be called that if you remember that leave a comment in the comment section but i don't let it's a wednesday morning it's focus day for me if you know i don't have any calls other than the weekly dev check-in meeting that i do for my team uh, i think i'm done with the calls for the day anything else will be just dev related so spend the day with me again and let's see how my day goes and let's code away i'll let you know what i'm working on and what has been some interesting things that have been happening so stay tuned enjoy the vlog time is about 10 past 12 and what am i working on today so yeah quite a lot happens within a week as i did mention last time today what i'm working on is an integration i think i've said too much integration on this channel but let me just give you a bit of background i was working on another project which wanted me to do an import of some data right you import the data into that system and from then i need to get that data to another system of ours so that's the integration that i'm working on it's not what i was talking about last time so yeah that's i've started on it and i've taken a bit of uh time to do some research on what i wanted to go about it and i've decided to do it in a background job and yeah i'm not sure if you know what a background job is but uh essentially if you want to do something heavy in the back end and you don't want it to like block current task you can schedule it so that you can do it in the background and not interfere with the current uh functionality of the system so it can just get done in the background while people are still using the system so that's what basically background schedule constraint jobs are and that's what i'm currently doing so yeah i hope that is insightful i'm not sure if all of you are mostly in the back end or whatnot but that's what i'm currently working on i think i should be done with the integration to get that data to the other system today and then from then i'll just configure some and also write some code to make sure that even if you want to send back something of back as a response or something like that you can still do that so that's what i'm up to uh let me know what you're up to in the comments if you're learning something new something interesting what are you up to what are you up to let us know in the comments you do know i read the comments so yeah it's 12 i'm gonna push for like 30 to 45 minutes and then we're gonna go for lunch there's a few things i need at the shop most likely might go there but we'll be making the food ourselves we're not gonna be ordering out because apparently many all i do is order out so we're gonna try to not do that yeah let's get back to business man I'm not sure if you remember but we have our own portfolio and Gamlet didn't like that we haven't touched it in a while that's why they sponsored this video let me show you all something cool so basically Gamlet is the easiest way to load images and videos on your website stupid fast so what they do is optimize your images for better load time and better quality making it resizing to stream it best wherever you are so what they do is just take a link drop it in optimize it you don't have to change anything and then you just take the link that is of the optimized picture voila you're done let me actually show you a real life example with our portfolio because i told you they didn't like that i didn't touch it so you see right here this is the image 
that I have on my journey calendar. If you remember, it's just like images of my journey throughout. So what I did is put where the source is coming from. They support anything from S3 bucket, Google Cloud, and all of that. And this one is a web folder. So I hosted it on the web. And you can see the before. And they optimized the picture to look this good, to keep the quality as it is, and still have a better format. So that was really cool. And you can see the clear difference between the two. And you can see also the size has shrinked, but the quality is still fine. And the better part is they also host videos. This is all on the free platform as well. So. I've uploaded one of my videos and you can see now we have a watch vlog. You can actually watch vlog inside my portfolio. City of mine. It's not on YouTube. You can decide who can see it and it can be accessed throughout the internet if you want to, if you make it public. So that was really dope. That was really dope. Now I have a watch vlog inside my video. And all thanks to Gamlet for sponsoring this video and showing you something cool. There's a dev site. You can see the documentation and everything just one liners you can copy the code even after uploading your video quite simple man you get straight to the point so make sure you check the link in the description and they do have a lifetime deal on AppSumo. i've put the link in the description as well it's up to 77 percent off so make sure you check it out and make some better portfolios man so i can review them what you waiting for link in description Thought I had to try to make no mistakes I prep ahead of time I'm never late Make it there on time Don't bring down the moon Greet them with a smile I thought that it was smart Stay in my lane Always hit the mark Thought that was the way To get a head start Perfection's the play I had the leading part I realize you never get a medal in the end No, no one's gonna give you any credit I was playing a game But no one else seemed to participate And I can't believe I got so judgy I don't know what got into me Can't believe I let it get so ugly I let it It's really crazy what happens in a day some way, somehow, I got myself now testing something that I was supposed to do on Monday, but there was a lot that's happening. So I'm trying to export the database now to my local so that I can test it out. And it decides that it wants to take its time. It is four now. I'm supposed to give an update around half past four on how I found the testing. But it seems like I won't be able to do that because this DP is taking its sweet time. I think it's just going to take about 10 gigs in my laptop. I need extended storage, man. So I did request a new laptop at work, but oh, I don't think I'm going to get it anytime soon. So that that is fine, I guess. So now I'm just going to continue with my integration, I guess, because um, I had to stop and try to give someone else a tester. One of the testers that I worked with uh, wanted something so that they can test some authentication and yeah authentication on this other app that we are working on so i had to do some few things there so they can be able to test and now i have to test this other integration that we work with with one of our legacy system something is not working right that's why i'm doing that and while i'm also doing this other one that i talked about earlier on so it's quite a lot going on but yeah it's 4 p.m been a long day uh today is cardio day we're supposed to take a run i don't think we're gonna go to the gym and for anyone who was asking about my exercises that i don't train legs i train legs on monday and i usually don't vlog on monday i was way too busy to even vlog on monday so unfortunately i'm not gonna do that this week and I, I did mention that this might be the last vlog of the year right yeah so i don't want anyone to come for me in the comments so yeah Let's continue, we still have about 1 hour 30 minutes, I'm gonna go for a run around 6, so actually 2 hours, we still have about 2 hours to do some nice implementation and I think the testing we're gonna leave it for tomorrow, so it, the aim will be to push as much as I can to push some implementations and tomorrow start testing, I think if we can do that, then we're all good.
they're definitely not gonna believe me. It is half past four and the DP is still trying to import. I don't know if my laptop is way, 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 way too slow or there's something wrong cause ain't no way, ain't no way, still trying to import. What, what am I supposed to do? How, how is this my fault? Ah, no, they'll get the update tomorrow because the DP is trying to import and I have to get this DP so that I can try to replicate the issue. Like I can't just use an old DP because it might be like uh, whatever I'm trying to do is not configured well on that specific DP. So, hey, it is what it is, man. <laughs> I ended up getting on a call and it lasted for about 30 minutes. Uh, one of the projects I was talking about is we just created like a production site for it. So I just wanted to com confirm everything, blob storage and everything, make sure everything is fine before I can start running like our background jobs to import stuff. So yeah, that is fine. A lot of noise there and it is time for me to hit the road. Today I'm jogging, it's cardio day. So just get to the road before it gets too dark. The time is about six past six. So let's go down the road. Thank you for watching. I will catch you on the next one. The section now is just gonna be me running and trying to fight for my life. So if you want to see that you'll stick around but and that thanks for watching thanks for tuning in i'll see you on the next one cool stuff man are we